This is a Chucky Beat production. So we're going to go in with our L'Oreal True Match Super Blendable Foundation in the color 10.C. Just a little bit, you don't need too much. And just with light strokes, start to blend the foundation into your skin. You can see that this foundation color is a good match. Just make sure that you evenly spread it out. By the looks of this, I think I'm going to need a little bit more. Just for my forehead. Not too much now. Mm -hmm. Nearly done. Now it's always good to be able to check your color. Check that it's blended in well. You can see there's no difference between the color of my neck and my face. So it is indeed a true match. So get your spoolie brush and brush out those eyebrows because I'm going to be filling them in. That's my brow palette. The details are in the description box. Now it's good to Always when doing your brows, start with the lighter brown color on the inner part of the brow and then go in with the black on the outer part of the brow. This makes it look more natural. Not too much, we just want to fill in any sparse areas. Take your spoolie brush and brush the eyebrows again. Just blending it in. Now I'm going to go in with my MUA Winter Frost Matte Collection palette using a light color. Chino is the color. This just makes the eyes pop, it's very complimentary to my skin tone, nothing too apparent, but it gives a nice effect. As you can see in this makeup tutorial that I'm applying most of the makeup items with my fingers. And that's why this is so simple. It's this simple everyday makeup for dark skin and it works. I'm now gonna go in with the number seven from Boots, the makeup range from Boots. Number seven, Dramatic Lift Mascara for the ultimate wide awake look. And from what I'm seeing, they're not lying. My eyes are looking wide awake. The brush on this really grips the lashes well. Mm. Now when I apply my mascara on the bottom lashes, I just do it for the lashes in the corner. I don't take it all the way up into the inner part of the eye. I don't find this necessary. 
Now we're gonna go in with every black woman's favorite lip liner color. It's the MAC Chestnut Lip Liner. And line those lips up. Now I'm gonna apply the number seven lipstick. Really nice lipstick range that they have. It's the Moisture Drench in Nutmeg Spice. It feels creamy and smooth. And Boots, by the way, is a UK drugstore or pharmacy. Looking good. Now just blend that line in. Get yourself a brush. Because we're going to go in now with the number seven blusher in Plum Velvet. Now, as you can see, I am using the brush on the side of the bristles, not the actual base of the bristle, because that will just apply too much. So just keep on blending in until you're satisfied with how it looks. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe, leave a comment, and share this video. Now I'm just going back in with a beauty blender to get rid of any excess shine. We want a lovely, nice, dewy finish. Yes, honey. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video. Stay connected to The Roots.